Hey, 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 mambo vipi, mambo vipi, ladies and gentlemen, wherever you're watching us from. Hope you had a good night, a good morning, a good evening, a good lunch hour. Welcome so much to Mkenya Marekani. Uh, if you can hear me, just show me, say hi, hi, I'm listening to you, I'm watching you, I'm, I can hear your voice. Just tell me, tell me, tell me. And I uh, remember, as usual, when you come here, you have to share this platform because today we're going to be talking about a very important uh, topic about how to fill the green card lottery, okay? And um, I, many people uh, are not aware or may, maybe they think it's very hard, but it's a very easy process, okay? Uh, the green card lottery is just about uh, like one, one, two pages. That's all. That's all you need, okay? So uh, share, share, so that uh, before I start, so that we can have a quorum, and so we can go on. So make sure you share, make sure you share, make sure you share, make sure you share. Uh, let me see who is joining us. Uh, Tabin Jerry, and I say my hi, thank you so much. Uh, Tabin Jerry, thank you so much. Make sure you share to all your groups. Share to all your Facebook groups. Tuende tukiendaga. Aya, Ali Shuko, and I say my hi, thank you so much. Uh, Miriam Muya, thank you so much. Tuned in. Uh, Sante Sana, make sure you share. Make sure you share. Make sure you share. Uh, I see my friend uh, Gross Vena uh, Modoni. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, she's bought a, a, a sticker. Thank you so much. By the way, if you're joining from Facebook, uh, YouTube, you can uh, buy some stickers. That's how you support us. You can buy some stickers. You can become a member of Kenya Marikani. And that's how you support us. And uh, today I have, by the way, uh, one of the uh, jumpers from Kenya Marikani. Yeah? Can you see this? Uh, let, me, let me move this way. Yeah? This is from Kenya Marikani. Yeah? You can buy this and actually the sh uh, shipping is free. Shipping is free, okay? You can buy this uh, very nice jumper. Okay, let me... Uh, I don't want to move. My phone is on my laps. So look at this. So nice, yeah? Kenya Marikani. So you can support us also. The link is on uh, the YouTube uh, channel. You can buy and shipping all over America is free. Absolutely free. So uh, you can also uh, support us in that way. We are, we've started a foundation that will be helping people around here in Seattle, Washington. And uh, whatever we sell, that's going to be going into that. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, Kedu Koshen and Asema. Hi, watching. Thank you so much. Uh, James Mary. Yeah, thank you so much. Tuned in. When you come here, make sure you share. Make sure you share. Uh, Benitez, Julian. No masana, bro. No masana. Yes, yes. Even in Germany, you can buy this jumper. Yeah, you can buy this jumper. You can uh, buy yourself. Uh, you see, this This is a phone uh, phone case. You can get this phone case. And they're different. They're different. This is just an example. There are so many cases uh, you can buy for, for different. Mostly for iPhone and uh, Samsung, Samsung. Okay. Okay. Uh, if you have any questions regarding uh, B1, B2, green card, just bring them. But mostly we are dealing today with green card. We'll, we'll be talking about how to fill a green card, okay? Uh, if I have been in the States for eight months with a B1, B2 visa, am I eligible to apply for a green card? My visa is still valid through. Okay, uh, bro, uh, first of all, it depends if you are you started applying the asylum or not, okay? But if you've not, uh, you can still apply for a green card, okay? You will still be able to qualify. Uh, I see Maureen Shiko. Thank you so much. Uh, Maureen Shiko, make sure you share, make sure you share, and also subscribe to our YouTube channel. It's called Mkenya Marekani. Mkenya Marekani, as I was telling you, this jumper is, uh, you can support Mkenya Marekani by getting this good stuff. Yeah? Good stuff, good stuff. Yeah? It's all, uh, and, and, and phone case. If you want a phone case, if you want a company, your company logo to be here, I can make sure I put that for you. If you want your picture, your daughter's picture, your girl's picture, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, your wife, I can put a picture on for you on your case. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, thank you so much. Kedu Kosen. Uh, God bless you. God bless you. You can buy a super sticker here on um, Kenya Marekani on YouTube, by the way. You can support us. You can become a member. You can buy a super sticker and uh, yeah, you know, we are trying to bring as much information as we can so that we can help our people, okay? Uh, uh, jo Mr. Joffrey Alemba from Kenya, all the way in Kenya. Thank you so much. God bless you. Make sure you share this. Uh, and also you can uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel. It's called Kenya Marikani. And 
click that bell put that bell okay put that bell uh mr kenneth kimani thank you so much uh, my brother from another mother thank you so much i see you i see you brother i see you brother uh i see you i see you thank you so much so uh if you have any questions regarding green card ask me ask me right now okay but i will go direct now to uh, what we are planning uh our 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 talk for today is the dv visa program okay dv visa program okay this is the website that you go to it's uh it's called uh dvprogram.state.gov dvprogram.state.gov okay uh that's the the, the uh, website you need to go to and as i told you earlier there are so many fake websites many fake uh, websites out there make sure you're you're careful on if it ends with a dot com dot g uh dot ke dot whatnot just know it's not legit okay don't pay anybody because uh, green card is free green card is free and the uh instructions there are very easy unless you don't understand english or you don't you cannot access internet otherwise uh it's so easy and straightforward okay anybody can feel so uh remember the dates i will keep repeating this the dates are on they've they, we started yesterday october 6th 2021 uh to november 9th 2021 don't wait until the last minute don't wait until the last minute make sure you uh go straight ahead if you have your passport ready uh and if your passport is about to expire you can still you can still apply because uh until may you can apply and then get a new passport if you think you're applying a new passport will will not uh, be until uh, maybe not the end of november the beginning of november maybe you can uh apply with your old passport which uh, maybe maybe expires maybe in a month or so you can still you can still apply with that okay and then you apply for a new one then you will have to go with both passports okay uh because sometimes the numbers like i have two passports those numbers are not the same so you have to make sure you have the old passport don't throw it away yeah and also as you go for your interview you'll need the old passport because uh that's what you applied with okay so uh remember uh we, we, the deadline is 9th of november so don't wait until that last minute sometimes even the a website hangs okay so don't wait until the, the last uh, minute and then we have entry instructions which i did in my previous video entry instructions there is a lot of instructions here uh i did these instructions uh, in my previous video and there is a lot a lot of these instructions okay uh but uh and then also the photo the photo the photo uh, passport photo american size is two by two so uh make sure that's a song i will sing and by the way what i realized is you can also take a nice picture with your phone with a white background but then when you're uploading uh, this website has a place where you can uh, match up your you, you can size up your photo okay so uh but uh i always suggest just go to a, a, a good photographer otherwise you might do a selfie then uh, i mean uh, you can do your own picture with your phone but then uh, maybe it, it ends up having shadows on your eyes it's not clear so uh unless your phone is those phones eh <laughs> okay yeah but uh there's a lot of questions here also on the instructions i'm gonna tackle this on monday so on monday we're gonna uh let me just let me just click so that you see some of the steps we have the first 15 steps that are very important for you to um Yeah, these are these are the instructions here okay so uh the requirements eligibility requirements okay uh and then we have we have all these requirements uh, number two i which i talked in the in my previous video and then you have to uh, enter your your uh application in between the entry period don't try to enter it too early or too late okay otherwise you'll be disqualified otherwise i already talked about the name the name has to be the same as, as your passport the name that you enter has to be the same as your passport i talked about gender i talked about birth date uh, i talked about city so this is all a repetition and it's in a, in a in a in a different video also i'm just repeating for the sake of those people who are not here in the other video okay
okay so let's go here now begin entry okay are you still there if you're still there say hi because i i can't see my screen <laughs> are you still there let me see are you still there uh yes i see yeah S somebody's asking is it possible to feel uh, for those who are in kenya yes absolutely it's possible because some people maybe in kenya don't have the internet okay yeah you can feel for someone in kenya yeah that's very possible uh alice wanji wanjiru says i'm tuned in from nairobi i have a question nikisha jaza yangu successfully na submit na nipewe namba kuna vile naweza recheck vile nilijaza no you have to only recheck before you submit okay once you submit that's done once you submit that's done okay yeah uh Oh, Ali Shuku says, uh, yes, they can see me. Uh, uh, Kenneth uh, say, uh, says hi. So I, I see you guys are still watching, okay? And remember to share, remember to share, remember to share. Uh, okay, so let's go back to uh, what we were talking about, okay? Uh, so when you enter to the uh, dvprogram.state.gov slash application.asps, uh, you will find a code just to, to show that you're human, okay? you answer that code it's different to every uh, person um then you submit so there we go that's that's now our this is the dv diversity visa entry form okay so it's it's a very easy it's a very easy and straightforward application okay so let's let's try to feel uh to feel okay le let me show you a passport first of all uh le let's go let's go back let's go back let's go back um with your passport let me just show you an idea of what a passport looks like and where your details are um what is this okay
so uh you see you see what happened is uh when i was trying to feel this you have to be very fast you have to be quick quick when you're feeling this information you have to be very quick otherwise uh it's you are you're like in a <laughs> tiktok yeah tiktok timer okay so uh make sure you feel very fast so that but because i'm showing you i had to go slowly by slowly so that you can understand but basically i finished the info, uh, i finished that that uh that um, submission okay the next thing is just to confirm everything is correct then submit okay basically i've finished uh, but you have to be on time you have to be quick 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 because uh you're on timer so otherwise it gets uh you can repeat this uh, issue for us for us, uh, such a long time and it happens all also to uh visit a visa you have to save for the ds160 you have to keep saving keep saving before you go to the next thing save what you've written otherwise you will start afresh uh let's see some of the questions that are coming in um uh steven mwangi says tuned in uh -huh. uh gross gross vena mudoni says hi yes karibu sana thank you so much i've been applying since 2005 may god remember me now yes yes just just keep applying but you have to make sure your uh, every information that you give you've cross checked and uh, it's uh, filled correctly uh, there is no typos there is no what not yeah uh hana by sadia more info about spousal visa uh spousal visa is also uh, you also you also get a green card uh spousal visa is is uh, it's kind of different from this green card uh, especially if your spouse is american citizen if your spouse is an american citizen then uh, and you're filing it from kenya or from where you are it's actually very straightforward um, and the process can be can maybe be one year or two years depending on how your situation is so uh but eventually after they approve your marriage because one thing they, the first thing they have to do is approve that your marriage is legit once they approve your, mar your marriage is legit now you go through the same process as the green any lottery like lottery you have to go for medical check then you have to uh, uh, get your interview but your inter interview is almost guaranteed you will still get it because they've already done a scrutiny of you and uh, uh, they know you inside out i'm tell i'm telling you even your messages you have to like bring a, a a form you print all your messages from your emails your inboxes your sms's because they want to see this marriage is legit okay uh steven uh steven mwange says haina sauti nini haina sauti uh okay okay uh, i see also guys on my instagram let me see i've not forgotten you guys uh hi green card ukishapata na ufaulu what next so what next you're com you're coming to the us <laughs> yeah somebody uh achi carol is asking that uh name she hello jamaina hello okay thank you thank you so much uh, i see a lot of guys uh, joining in from instagram what if i come we stay hey, hey. <laughs> hey. ah yeah sawa 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 naona naona uh sorry guys there is a lot of people here on instagram because i'm also try trying to stream this live also on instagram um normal injury says uh yeah green card is free of charge application is free 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 um let me see sorry guys i i, I was concentrating here on uh yeah this is um i'm uh nakuna kitu ka letter from a family that can support you from the occupant of school public charge uh okay what happens what happens is uh the, you the process here is first of all to get the green card once you get the green card that's when you will have to get a host somebody to host you so that uh you come here in the us and you have a place to stay otherwise uh it's gonna be hectic for you if you don't have a place to stay here in the us you, you must have a place to stay here in the us okay so guys on instagram please if you can go to my youtube channel and subscribe uh because i'm not able to multitask as 
Uh, oh, if 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 it uh come we stay in marriage, those those ones are not. You're single, my friend. You're single unless you have uh that document from the government, which is like eight hundred shillings. Uh, at least I I'm not sure. I'm I'm not sure right now. Maybe it's less than twelve hundred, if I'm not so wrong. So uh, please make sure. Uh, if you are married, you must have that certification from the government. Uh, it will save you a lot of hassle, okay? If you, especially if you want to apply for your husband as well, because if you win, for example, you are you are capable of applying for your husband. So, but if you don't have the paperwork, he's not your husband. He's not your husband. That's what I'm trying to say, okay? Uh, I hope that uh, normalcy in theory. I hope I answered your question. Yeah. So let's continue. Let's continue. Uh -huh. Let me see on on. Uh, this is from Facebook. Uh, Miriam Moya says, uh, "Me na taka ni apply ni apply." Oh, ni apgani. Okay, the website is here. Let me let me just show you the website again. Uh, the website for the green card is here. That's the website. You go to uh, uh, HTTPS uh, and then it's dvprogram.state.gov. Okay. Once you are there, you'll be able to scroll down. Also, if you applied in the previous years, that's the place, same place where you can be able to see uh, if you, you, you are qualified. Okay. If you are picked. Uh, yeah, let's go to, let's see who else is asking. Ask all your questions. Eh? Uh huh. If you don't if you don't have a, a passport you cannot apply because as you saw when i was trying to fill this uh, there's a place for passport so if you don't have a passport uh you cannot apply but if your passport is about to expire you can still apply but then renew your passport because if you apply today the results are gonna come out in may so you still have a lot a lot of time to get a new passport um yeah, Sadia Wamboi says, hi, Asante Sana. Uh, Sally Mwangi says, following, thank you so much. Uh, Maura Zipora, hi. Uh, thank you so much, thank you so much. Uh -huh. um, can you file for me, Gary? Oh, I've just shown you how to file, by the way. It's very easy. It's one page. It's like two pages maximum, two pages. So it's very easy to fill. Uh, and, uh, it's i've just shown you uh, let me let me even go back again to this to this form i show you guys it's a very easy form sorry i i was trying to feel but i was too slow because i was showing guys how to do it uh then uh, i delayed and time so let's go back yeah you see this is the form this is the form we are talking about yeah it's a very it's a very uh, easy form to feel very easy you see, and then when you continue, it just brings you the whole, whatever you filled. And then uh, the next thing is submit. Okay. So uh, it's it's a very easy process. If you have any questions regarding uh, this uh, uh, diversity visa uh, entry form, just ask me. Ask me right now. If you have any question regarding the diversity uh, form, just ask. Um, Okay, let's see. Let's see who else. Who else is, has a question? Um, yeah, Maura Zipora says, uh, "Good information, Mister Wainaina. Asante sana, asante." And then uh, I want to. I want you guys, if you're watching me, uh, please go back to our YouTube channel and subscribe. Uh, we have, this week, uh, next week, and uh, coming week, we're gonna be talking a lot about the green card uh, visa. And on Monday, I'm gonna be tackling if you're in the US and maybe you've uh, applied for asylum. Can you apply for uh, a green card? That's what we are going to be talking about on Monday. Okay. So make sure you uh, click uh, to the notification bell so that when we come on Monday, you'll be able to uh, be notified that we are live. Okay. Uh, Faith Dimit is an Asema. Uh, if you get qualified for the DV lottery, is there any amount that you are required to pay? Yes. So uh, basically, the application is free. 
but once you're selected then uh there's uh charges for the uh hospital medi- uh, med- medical check and then the there's um, costs for the visa itself which you pay at the uh, Nairobi embassy and then uh there's your flight okay so if you calculate it it sums up to a big amount by the way so um the application is free but after you picked after you selected you there's there's a lot of charges okay so uh yeah yeah yep yep uh somebody on on instagram says uh juma junior 09 says hi wainaina do you mean if someone does doesn't have a passport then he or she cannot apply for green card visa yes because uh as you've seen let's go back to this form let's go back to this form i'm going to show you something okay here it requires passport number so if you don't have a passport what number will you fill it requires a passport number here what number will you fill if you don't have a passport also it requires an expiration date if you don't have a passport what will you fill here okay and then country of insurance there's two on, there's only two options there is not an option of somebody without a passport there is only somebody with a passport and then somebody who has is passport exemption like you are you are stateless you don't have a nationality and if you don't have a nationality you must have also another paper okay you can't say i don't have a nationality just with your mouth you have to show in paper there is a paper people are given if you don't have a nationality also uh for example if a national of communist controlled country and unable to obtain your passport from the government some 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 places uh the uh, the uh, your passport becomes the government uh, property okay so the government holds your passport so unless you are in that situation but other than that uh unable to obtain a passport and have received an individual waiver from of the passport requirement by the secretary of homeland security or secretary of state so you see those are the only circumstances where you can apply without a passport so other than that you cannot say i don't have a passport and that's all you must have you must show like um, something from the security of homeland security or secretary of state yeah yeah so uh, you must have a passport that's how how much how much is the visa okay the visa which visa now the after you've won your green card the, the the visa application is mostly expensive more than uh, the tourist visa so maybe we're talking about 25 to 30000 or 35000 there about yeah but i'm not sure you have to check that online yeah um so uh learn spanish with susan oh yeah gary what you wanna fa wakulipe yes please if you go <laughs> if you go to my to my youtube channel you can you can press that dollar sign okay once you press that dollar sign you can be able to appreciate the work we are doing here uh i want to see some people doing that and also on instagram you can buy a uh, uh, if you're watching me from instagram you can buy a badge okay because we are giving you a lot of information man <laughs> yeah. uh, yeah medical medical checkup also is is expensive and it will depend uh for example i always tell guys uh there is vaccines that you need to get there is um you cannot come here with uh tb tb you cannot uh, come here with syphilis for example uh so those are the diseases that are uh are strictly cut out but uh tb you, you have to be treated in kenya and that treatment can only be done in that hospital uh next to the embassy which will cost you some big amount of money so uh yeah and that's the only place you can go uh like how much am i supposed to pay to pay for what process, process? like there is medical there is your visa there is your ticket if you win okay and by the way uh the us embassy tells everybody don't buy any ticket before you win your green card before you get your b1 b2 visa don't get your ticket don't buy your ticket otherwise it's going to be so hard for you when you hear you didn't qualify 
yeah so uh guys who are watching make sure you share make sure you share and uh, uh let's see if you're on uh, if you're on uh, instagram please i want to see uh if you have any question on instagram uh, let me see let me see and also you can support gary Wenena by buying a badge if you're on youtube let me see who is watching on youtube um yep yep uh, yeah thank you so much for guys if you just go to uh the emoji see the emoji on on your charts on youtube if you press that emoji you can be able to support gary Wenaina. if you press the dollar sign you can either uh become you can get a super sticker or super chart or you can also uh get that uh, membership okay yeah hope i've answered most of your questions okay let me see let me see uh mr eric Gdui, thank you so much uh thank you so much uh thank you so much uh uh i see mr eric Gdui has bought a sticker thank you so much hey, 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 hey. yes 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 nimeshika simu moja nimeshika simu moja instagram watu wananyona nyona kwa instagram nimeshika simu moja na mkono ya left so i cannot clap but let me appreciate you appreciate you yeah thank you so much thank you so much ah uh, yeah you can support gerwenena and as I, as i told you you can you can also buy these hoodies you see this hoodie mkenya marekani mkenya marekani hoodie yeah uh, this mic yeah uh, can you see this hoodie is very nice you can buy it on my shop on mkenya marekani if you look at the description you will find the link to go to that shop and by the way if you're in the us shipping is free shipping is free so you just buy it will be shipped to your house okay it's free if you need a, a, a phone case phone case like this you can also uh, get a phone case uh shipping is free shipping is free you have to just put the uh code gary gary you have to put the code gary and then uh it can be shipped for you free if you don't put the code you will pay for your own shipping you have to put the code gary 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 okay my name and i can also uh do different casing like if you need a case written something for your wife uh written manchester whatever not i can do it for you uh just let me know and then it will be shipped to your house we are in digital marketing okay yeah it's called a 21st century mode of business yeah uh let's see can you apply green card lottery while asylum case is pending no you cannot yeah we, we're gonna be tackling this case on monday uh in depth yeah but you you cannot and uh unless you've already gotten your approval and your one one uh, one year after your approval one year or two years i have to check that one year one year or two years of your approval that's when you can apply uh shogi fei says hi yeah thank you so much uh let's see again on uh yeah instagram i see a lot of people joining in thank you so much everybody for joining in yeah uh what about medical checkup uh medical checkup is um uh, is a process done by the uh you you will you will do it there's a place near nairobi embassy where you will be able to do that medical checkup there's a lot you do you have to get some vaccines you have to get um uh, what else you have to get vaccines for example if you turn positive on your tb you have to continue doing extra extra checks like you have to do sputum you have to do x-rays you have to do um if then it turns positive you have to go there for six months to take that medication for six months tb medication for six months yeah so uh make sure make sure you uh you at least especially once you apply for your green card start looking for a way where you can get some money because this process 
might delay depending on uh how well you are equipped okay because uh medical requires money a visa process requires money uh then plane ticket requires money so uh make sure you're prepared but it's good to start yeah practice your faith i am mkubwa jim barire mtu mzito mambo vipi bro karibu sana karibu sana thank you so much for tuning in uh, ingia pale kwenye youtube bana ingia pale kwenye youtube tu watazame pale tuko ndani ndani sana yeah tuko ndani sana pale na to support yeah asante sana asante sana thank you yeah uh let me see yeah any more questions before we conclude this session any more questions before we conclude this session yeah please go to our youtube channel and subscribe uh to mkenya marekani click that bell uh in my previous video i've talked a lot about green card i've also talked a lot uh just on tuesday we talked about how to open an, an adult home family home here in uh, seattle washington that interview was good yeah we were talking to a teacher who taught us a lot and uh, please go go to that video watch it also today in the morning we launched a video we talked with nadia mokami she is here in the us and is a great inspirational video so please go and watch that video as well uh but there is a lot of green card uh stories that i've put so just go and watch and watch and watch and share and share also you can support us by just uh sharing on your stories and tagging gary wenaina i'm available on instagram uh as gary wenaina also on kenya marekani tv you can go support us there ah and do you sasa ingia kwenye youtube pale ingia kwenye youtube sana yeah ah yeah My friend Jen Bogo 2021 joining in thank you so much uh Njeri Muirika thank you so much all these guys joining in in uh, Instagram thank you so much I see you I see you I see you eh? okay um so any more question any more questions regarding your green card uh how can people get married and change change their status and forego asylum and green card they cannot that's a different process okay that that's that's a that's a different process uh because you are being married to an american citizen which is so different yeah uh so that's absolutely very different but uh i've said if your case is still pending you cannot apply for a green card but if you if you if you've been approved then you can apply for a green card Yeah. So uh let me one more time show you the form before uh we'll bring this show to a conclusion so that you can be able to see. So this is the form for green card and you find it on uh dvprogram.state.gov. That's where you find this uh form and I I filled this form slowly by slowly. Slowly by slowly if you have any question regarding how this form it's very easy it's like two pages only and you're done very easy it's not a, a a big process yeah but here for your photo it has to be two by two yeah on a white background i also talked about uh, the correct picture on my previous video so just go back on my previous video and watch the photo and then also your email make sure you have access to this email address otherwise it it's going to be hard for you to know if you are selected so make sure you have an email that you can access okay yeah here you have to have a certificate if you are married if you are unmarried if you are divorced you have to have that certificate if you are divorced you have to have a certificate is not divorced by mouth okay you have to have a certificate to show yeah Yep uh if there is no any other question I believe uh, we will end this broadcast here if there is no any other question we'll bring this to a close so make sure you go to our youtube channel and subscribe like comment and share ama namna gani yes 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 kama kawaida kama kawaida let's support one another and uh we'll see you if you need any of these nice jumpers just go to the uh 
to Mkenya Marikani uh, on on YouTube you'll see on the description you'll see the link there where you can buy it's shipping is free all over America so as long as you put the code Gary okay my name yeah okay so we'll see you next time uh, uh on on tomorrow tomorrow yeah uh, tomorrow is a Friday yeah tomorrow we also be tackling uh, uh, questions regarding green card as well so uh, please also join us tomorrow and we'll be talking still more about green card all your questions will will still be answering them at that point in time so see ya god bless you and remember to subscribe